Hey everyone, it's time for another tipsbychris.com tip video. And for those of you who are more or less used to Windows machines and have just moved over to a Mac, here's a tip that you might not know about that um, people who just moved over to Macs uh, are very pleased to say that they've always uh, had this ability to do, whereas Windows users would have had to have actually purchased software or uh, use some third-party download that uh, bombarded you with ads but creating PDFs on a Mac is pretty easy and you actually have the ability to create PDFs with almost anything you can print on a Mac so for instance uh, we have a web page our tips by Chris website here and say we wanted to go ahead and make a PDF of this website either to store or to send to somebody uh, whatever the reason may be if you can print it, you can actually create a PDF. So simply all we would have to do is, using Firefox, we hit File, Print. And when the print screen comes up, on the bottom left corner, we have the ability to save as PDF. You don't need to worry about any of these other settings. Just simply click on PDF and Save as PDF. Then we can name the file here at the top where we'll name it something like um, our PDF screen dot PDF and save it to our desktop and simply save it. The file then gets put together as if it was being printed and it will then send it all out to the desktop here. So here we have our PDF just created by double clicking on that it will launch our PDF screen and here we have the PDF. This is exactly how it would have printed on your printer as well. Um, you don't see the videos of course because the videos were taken off and that was probably what the little script error was running but nonetheless you have that ability to now create PDFs that you didn't have on Windows so easily. But for those of you window viewers want to know if you have the ability to do it, yes you do. You could actually purchase uh, other software to do the same thing and for that we'll show you our Windows screen here. So this is actually Windows running on our Mac but it does the same thing. For Windows you'd actually be able to go hit file and print but you'd need third-party software like Adobe PDF or um, there's some free ones out there that you can get but just be careful you do get a lot of ads but you can click OK and it'll ask you the same thing is to name the file here so we would then name it in our screen PDF and hit save and it would then generate the PDF and send it to our desktop as well so it does have the ability but for those Mac users you have it free you can actually do it all the time now for you Windows users well maybe one day they'll incorporate it in the Windows operating system but till then here is our PDF that's created using Adobe PDF in Windows. I hope that this is a great tip for you. If you have any questions or if you have anything you'd like to learn on your what you can do on your computer, simply add your comments or send an email out to us and uh, we'll make a video on uh, a Tips by Chris video just for you. Thanks for watching and have a great day.